Hi, my name is Joanna Mel, and today I'm going to teach you how to play Casey's Jig, which is a jig I wrote for one of my students. So I'm going to play it for you first and then teach you how to play it. actually in D Dorian which starts on D E F G A B C D and your harp should be tuned in C. So all you need to know is three little patterns going up, going down, and then a fifth and a third. And that's really it. So let's start with three on D above middle C. Here's my middle C. We're going to put three on D two on E, thumb on F, and go up, and get right back on, and go down, F, E, D. Now we're going to play a fifth, thumb on A, tuck your two, three on D. So we're going to play A, D, and then thumb on F, and two on D, F, D. Now you might have noticed that the A is a quarter note in jig time, which means two beats. So one, two, three, and the F, D, F is two beats, one, two, three. Okay, so I'll do it for you again slowly. D, E, F, F, E, D, A, D, And that's all you need to know. Now we're going to shift down one note in each finger to C, D, E. So three on C, two on D, thumb on E. C, D, E, E, D, C. Now thumb on G, tuck your two, three on C, play G, C, and now thumb on E, two on C, E. C. And now we're going to go back to D, E, F. Three on D, two on E, thumb on F. D, E, F, F, E, D. Now thumb on A, three on D. A, D, F, D, F, D. Now here's a little scale pattern. Thumb goes on high C, two on B, three on A. High C is the one above middle C. So, C, B, A, now thumb on G, two on F, three on E, four on D. G, F, E, D, and then two on D, D, D. Okay, so that's the first part. Now here's the second part. We're gonna shift up two notes in each finger. Three on F, two on G, Thumb on A. Here we go. F, G, A, A, G, F. Now thumb on C, three on F, C, F, thumb on A, two on F, A, F. Now we're going to shift down one note in each finger, three on E, two on F, thumb on G, E, F, G, G, F, E, now thumb on C, two, three on E, C, E, thumb on G, two on E, G, E, and we're back to the beginning, D, E, F, D, E, F, F, E, D, now thumb on A, three on D, A, D, Thumb on F, two on D, F, D, and our little 
little scale pattern, thumb on your high C, C, B, A. This time do a crossover with your thumb on G. G, F, B, D, D, D. I'm going to demonstrate that crossover one more time. So thumb on C, two on B, three on A. C, B, before you play your A, reach up with your thumb and over to G. Then play your A. Then replace your two on F, three on E, four on D. Then play your G. G, F, E, D, D, D. And that's Casey's jig. Now you're wondering, what am I gonna do with my left hand? Well, here's a very, very easy left hand, and in my next video, I'll show you the more complicated left hand. So you're just gonna take your two in your left hand and put it on low D, okay? And you're going to take your right hand, D, E, F, okay? Now this low D is going to play with the D in your third finger to start. So D's together. D, E, F, F, E, D. Now right thumb on A, three on D. Now we're going to play that low D with your thumb, your right thumb on A. Here it goes. two is going to go on low C and play with three, two, one, the third finger on middle C. C, D, E, E, D, C. And now the low C is going to play with your thumb, your right thumb on G in the right hand. Okay, now we're back to D. is going to play with your right thumb on the A. Now a C in your left hand with the C up here. And D in the left hand. Okay, now we're going to shift up. Two on the F, the low F with the F in the, in the right hand three. with the C up here. Now we're going to go to E in the left hand with the E in the right hand. And E again with the C in the right hand. And then we're back to D in the left hand with D in the right hand, three. Ginger's Little Heart Book, and you can go to my website, joannamel.com, and click on Books and CDs and find Ginger's Little Heart Book, and you can actually preview all of the pieces. You can download some of the uh, previews and order on that site. Thank you so much for watching Casey's Jig, and I'm going to make another video with that more complicated left hand. Bye-bye.